The 2021 NFL season kicks off in Ramey James Stadium with the Dallas Cowboys versus the defending Super Bowl champions, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. The last time the Bucs played in a game at home, they won the Super Bowl. Dak Prescott is fully healthy and ready to lead his team in this high-powered offense. We took to Instagram to take polls. What did you guys believe? Who was going to win? 77% believe that the Bucs will beat the Dallas Cowboys. A little lopsided right there. We'll see if it happens. Moving into the first NFL Sunday of the season, the Texans host the Jaguars in an AFC South matchup. The anticipated debut of Trevor Lawrence and Urban Meyer will be one to watch, while the Texans will have to make do without their star quarterback. Houston is out to prove everyone wrong this year. And according to the polls, we've got the Jaguars winning. 72% believe it's going to be the Jaguars that beat the Texans. Vegas may say he's got a chance to win NFL MVP, but Justin Herbert's got a rough start as he leads the LA Chargers on the road against the Washington football team. Ron Rivera added many offensive pieces to help complement his already ferocious defense. And to make matters worse, the Chargers could be without Austin Eckler. And on Instagram, the Chargers are favored to win 64% over the Washington football team. Russell Wilson and the Seahawks travel to the Midwest to take on the Indianapolis Colts. The Seahawks have locked in Jamal Adams this offseason, which is tough news for a team with so many underlying injuries in the Colts. However, Carson Wentz is ready to go and make his debut. And on Instagram, who do you guys feel is going to win this game? 81% favoring the Seahawks over the Colts, not really giving Indianapolis a shot in this. The ax forgets, but the tree remembers. Sam Darnold and Robbie Anderson look to get even against their former team, the New York Jets. Zach Wilson had himself a great preseason, but with now having to keep up with the Carolina offense that has Christian McCaffrey back healthy, this could be tough. Who do you guys believe is going to win this game? The Carolina Panthers are favored to win, according to you guys by the polls that we asked. 76% over 24% in favor of the New York Jets. How will this offensive line hold up? The Minnesota Vikings against the Cincinnati Bengals. The star power is there on the offense for the Vikings. And same goes for the Bengals, who have Joe Burrow now healthy enough to open up the season. But can he be protected at all costs? What do you guys believe? Who is going to win this game? The Minnesota Vikings favored 78% to the Bengals, 22%. These two teams made the Super Bowl in our schedule simulation, Arizona Cardinals versus the Tennessee Titans. For those wondering, it was the Titans that ended up winning the whole thing in our simulation. Will year three be a significant one for Kyler Murray, and how will the Titans look with the addition of Julio Jones? According to you guys who took the polls to Instagram, the Tennessee Titans are favored to win 73% and 27% are in favor of the Arizona Cardinals. They're fully healthy and ready to go. The 49ers look to regain their Super Bowl form against Dan Campbell and the Detroit Lions. Detroit is projected to be one of the worst teams this year, but they can make a statement in this game. The 49ers are back healthy, and you guys believe that they're going to win this game 88%, and 12 of you are sticking with the Detroit Lions, the underdogs in this game. Najee Harris will make his NFL debut with the Steelers against Josh Allen and the Buffalo Bills. This is a rematch of a Sunday night game from last year, but the Steelers are hoping there's a different outcome this time around. Could this be another incredible season from Josh Allen? Take it to the polls. What do the Time to Football fans believe? The Buffalo Bills, 72% of you believe, are going to beat the Pittsburgh Steelers, who are favored 28%. Two new head coaches face each other as the Eagles travel to the Benz and face the Atlanta Falcons. The confidence level in Jalen Hurts seems to be low, while Matt Ryan's days in Atlanta might be coming to an end sooner rather than later as well. But this season, we've got Matt Ryan as the starting quarterback, and 53% of you still take the Eagles over the Atlanta Falcons, 47% in favor of the Falcons. The Browns were so close in pulling off the upset in the playoffs, and they're hoping this game against the Chiefs has a different outcome. Cleveland is set to prove that last year wasn't a fluke, while the Chiefs continue to be one of the best teams in the NFL. And given that they are the best teams, 84% of you guys favor the Chiefs, and only 16% are 
are going with the Browns in this game. A new era begins in New Orleans as Jameis Winston and the Saints face the Green Bay Packers. This matchup was actually moved to Jacksonville because of Hurricane Ida. Soak up every moment of seeing Aaron Rodgers and a Packers uniform this season because this year might be his last with the team. And 64% of you guys are favoring the Packers to beat the New Orleans Saints, 36% in favor of the Saints. Teddy Bridgewater will be starting for the Denver Broncos against the New York Giants. The Giants brought in a lot of offensive weapons, so no more excuses for Daniel Jones. Although, they do have a tough Broncos defense to get through. And on the polls, the time to football faithful like the Broncos to win. 56% of you guys voted the Broncos, 44% in favor of the Giants. So it's still kind of close. We'll find out if Bill Belichick's decision to start Mac Jones will be a good one as the Patriots take on the Miami Dolphins. Tua Tugavailoa has been practicing moving the ball down the field, and with his new toy in Jalen Waddell, and no more Stephon Gilmore for the first six weeks, will it happen? 46%, as a matter of fact, are favoring the Dolphins, but we're still giving the edge to the Patriots. 54% of you guys have voted for the Patriots to win this game. Sunday night football between the Chicago Bears and the LA Rams. The Rams had a huge blow last month when Cam Akers tore his Achilles, but they hope the addition of Matthew Stafford makes them a Super Bowl contender. The Bears stay committed and will ride with Andy Dalton over Justin Fields in this game. And because of that decision, 32% of you are in favor of the Chicago Bears, while 68% like the LA Rams, who could be a Super Bowl contender this season. And finally, there's only one Monday night game, so no staying up to 1 a.m. this year. The Baltimore Ravens versus the Las Vegas Raiders. Baltimore has to revise their game plan after losing J.K. Dobbins, while the Raiders' first-round pick, Alex Leatherwood, has a lot of pressure to fill in for a depleted offensive line. And because of that pressure, 83% voted for the Baltimore Ravens to beat the Las Vegas Raiders, only 17% in favor of the Raiders.